Yo, 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 I'm the magic part of Cubers, and today I'm going to do a cube review for beginners. My producer's over there is looking at my head because we were going to do something else. But anyway, it's my first cube. As you guys all know, the Chang Chao, beloved Chang Chao. And uh, this is a Rubik's brand. <laughs> and so let's do some uh, turns. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Anyways, um, uh, we are going to just look at all the cubes that I got and uh, how I make everything awesome with cubes. So, anyways, this is my 3x3 Rubik's Cube Chang Chao. Uh, it's the Chang Chao version, but uh, it's okay. Great cube. Anyways, I got that cube, and I also have. This cube. This is the uh the what? This is the Mega Mix cube. <laughs> and it's uh you know I really don't spend that much time using this cube just because I really don't know how to do a Rubik's cube, but that's okay. Because I have my producer over there who knows how to do it in like 10 seconds. And uh so yeah, my Mega Mix. This is a great cube for beginners. Um, basically, basically all you, the only thing that, you know what? Excuse the bad lighting. I'm gonna come up here. Anyways, basically all that happens, get away, producer. All that happens is uh, you 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 turn these corners right here. That's it. And somehow magically. It goes back together. But guess what? I did not. Oh, this is horrible. No, I can't. No. Anyways, that's how you mix it, and I don't know how to solve it. There you go. All right. So basically, <clears throat> all I'm gonna do is I have this really cool cube that I want to show you. Okay. Basically, all that happens is I gotta snap my finger and it comes to me magically. So uh, it's called the um, Bang Bao 5.0 5x5. And it's a great one for beginners if you wanna learn how to do the 5x5. Anyway, so I snap the finger and it shall magically come into my hand. There it is. So this is the uh, Bang Bao 5x5. Great for beginners. This is probably one of my favorite cubes only because it's just really cool. It's stickerless. Because I know that. And uh, yeah, so some sides are the orange side. It's a bit different color orange. I don't know if you can see that orange side. We got the white side. We got the red side. We got the blue side. We got the green side. We got the blue side. Anyway, so this is really easy to solve. So this is also one of my really favorite cubes, not only because of the self-retrieval, but also because of the self-solving. You can buy this on um, Cubes For You, which I am the founder. Um, you can buy this for only $1,283, that's it, but it's just so pricey because of the uh, self-coming cube and because of the, um, what's it called? Self-solving cube. Anyways, so uh, I think it's finely mixed. Yeah, it's, it's nicely mixed. So let me just show you. All I gotta do is snap my fingers twice and it shall solve. Ready? One, two. So there it is. Already solved to match your perfection. This is a great cube for um, people who don't know how to solve a Rubik's Cube like me, but hey, I like to impress people, like I just did to you, hopefully. Anyways, um, that's about it for the show. I hope you enjoyed uh, the magic part, uh, I mean the cuber part of Magic Cubers featuring me. You can go check out my channel because it's awesome below. Um, I don't do anything cool, but you should still watch it because I put it there. Anyways, until next time, bye. Cute. Skateboards. Yeah, I don't know.
Because he's not going okay. to because you deserve public humiliation. Oh, yeah. Anyways, until next time, adios. Stop, stop, stop. Fire. Memorize where this is. And come over here. I'm ready to see. Three, two, one, drop. You're not very good about this.